Another type of gateway is the AND gateway. The AND gateway provides a mechanism to create and synchronize parallel flows, as those that we saw in our order to cache process. In fact, the activities in the two parallel flows, ship, goods, and emit invoice, are independent of each other, can be performed in any order. I can first emit invoice and then ship the goods, vice versa. I could even perform them as at the same time, or one could be faster than the other, and even if they start at the same time, one would be finishing before the other. The end gateway can be used both as a split and as a join. In the case of a split, we take all outgoing branches. So, in terms of token semantics, as soon as we receive a token in the input branch of this end gateway, then two outgoing branches can be taken in parallel. In the case of the end join, we proceed when all incoming branches have completed. So here we need to wait. If we receive one token from one incoming branch, that is not enough. We need to wait for the other token to arrive in the other branch. And once we have a token in each of the incoming branches, then we can proceed by synchronizing these two tokens, meaning that we merge them back into a single token that we send to the output branch of the end join. Let's put the end gateway in context through an example. Let's consider the security check at an airport. This process starts once a boarding pass has been received, after which we proceed to the security check. Now here there are two activities that we can do in parallel. On the one end, as a passenger, we have to pass the security screening. And on the other end, our luggage itself has to go through the screening. Now, depending on the layout of the airport, as well as on the traffic of passengers on that particular day, we may perform one activity before the other. So, for example, we may first pass the security screening as a passenger, and then the luggage is screened, or, as often happens, we first leave the luggage on the screening belt, and as that activity is slowly performed, because there is a queue of luggages, we pass through the security screen. But only once both activities have been completed, then we can synchronize the two tokens coming from the two respective uh, parallel branches and proceed to the departure gate by sending a single token to the output branch of the end join.